Hi everybody, we're here. Allison is going to be our helper for the day and we are going to do a little rainbow dancing milk experiment. So we have some milk here and a dish and you'll need a little food coloring and some dish soap. So the first thing we're gonna do, we measured out about a cup of milk and we are going to pour the milk into our bowl. You want it to cover the bottom of the bowl. The next thing that we're going to do is you wanna add some color. So we have the food coloring here. We have red, yellow, blue, and green. And we are going to add about three to four drops right on top of the milk of each color. You can kind of spread it around. You can spread it. Like drop salt. Okay. There goes, here comes the yellow. And last the green. Now we have our drops of food coloring, but how are they gonna dance? Let's see, we're going to add a drop of food coloring. You can either do this on the tip of a Q-tip or your finger, or if Allison is just gonna, I think, put one drop Dish right soap. in the middle. And let's watch and see what happens. It's dish soap, not food coloring. Oh, sorry, dish soap. Whoa! Look at the dancing rainbow. So the more colors you add, the more they will dance. Should we see? No. Let's see if we put more colors in, if they continue to dance. Let's see, we'll try it, see if we can get it to go one more time. Okay, are you ready? Should we see? Here we go. Let's do one drip, see if we can get it to dance again. Nope, just work the one time. Well, there you have our dancing rainbow. It's really actually very beautiful. I wonder if we printed a piece of paper on that, if it would soak up the color. There you have some fancy marbled paper. Let's do the other side too. It will make a nice little. <coughs> beautiful. We just made a little rainbow paper print. All right, I hope you try it at your house. Have fun experimenting, mix it up, and uh, have a good time. See if you can make a dancing rainbow.